Users who are considering making a change from Windows to Linux or Linux to Windows commonly want to know the advantages and disadvantages of each of the operating systems. The Linux kernel and the new utilities and libraries which accompany it in most distributions are entirely free and open source. You can download and install Linux distributions. Microsoft Windows usually costs between $99 and $199 for each licensed copy. However Windows 10 is being offered as a free upgrade to current owners of Windows 7 or Windows 8. Linux operating systems have a steeper learning curve for the average uses. They frequently require a deeper understanding of the underlying system to perform day-to-day -day functions. Additionally, troubleshooting technical issue can be a more intimidating and complicated process than on Windows. However, some distributions such as Ubuntu and Linux Mint are designed specifically to ease the transition from Windows to a Linux environment. Windows E is one of the easiest desktop operating systems to use. One of its primary design characteristics is user-friendliness and simplicity of basic system tasks. Its ease lack of difficulty is considered a positive by users who want their system to just work. However, more proficient users may be frustrated by oversimplification of system tasks at the expense of fine-grained control over the system itself. Linux is notoriously reliable and secure has a strong focus on process management, system security and uptime. Although Microsoft Windows has made great improvements in reliability in recent years, it's considered less reliability than Linux. Many of the sacrifice it makes in the name of user-friendliness can lead to security vulnerabilities and system instability. There are thousands of programs available for Linux and many are available as easy-to-install software packages all for free. Also, many Windows programs can be run on Linux using compatibility layers such as Wine. Linux supports a wider array of free software than Windows. Windows commands the highest number of desktop users, and therefore the largest selection of commercial software. It also has the largest selection of video games by a wide margin. Linux hardware 15 years ago. Linux struggled to support new hardware. Manufacturers often considered Linux support a secondary concern. Furthermore, device drivers for Linux were created only by enthusiasts who devoted their own time and resources to making Linux compatible with new hardware. Since then, the Linux user base has grown exponentially. Today, the majority of hardware manufacturers give Linux support the same priority as Microsoft Windows. Windows Hardware Windows operating system is compatible with any hardware you might buy. Linux Security Linux is a highly secure operating system. Although attack vectors are still discovered, its source code is open and available for any user to review, which makes it easier to identify and repair. Microsoft has made great security improvement over the years, but is the OS with the largest user base, especially among invoice computer users. It is the primary target for malicious coders as a result of all major OS. Microsoft Windows E is the most likely to be the victim of viruses and malware. Linux is used by corporate, scientific and academic organizations of every size. It's used to power the development machines and servers at Google, Facebook, Twitter, NASA, and the New York Stock Exchange, just to name a few. On the desktop, it is used by technically proficient users who prioritize system security and reliability, and by enthusiasts who want to learn more about computers and how they work. It's also used to give new life to older hardware.
enable low-budget computing projects to succeed and serve as the operating system on single-board computers such as the Raspberry Pi. Microsoft Windows is usually the operating system of choice for games, invoice users, and business users who rely on Microsoft software. It doesn't run well on older hardware. Microsoft has introduced with Windows 10.